So there is an interesting observation in the pond. So Brenton decided he was gonna prank me and dye my pond blue. Well, if you notice, he also decided to dye my rocks blue as well. And he is in trouble for that. Not really, but we're gonna fix that. But as a part of that, I came out here this morning so we could see it in the daylight and we have been taken over by an invasive creature. And I'm pretty sure that is not the frog that did it. But if you look, I don't know if you can see all the black dots. But yeah, there are literally millions I think maybe not millions, but there's definitely thousands if not ten thousands of invasive tadpoles in my pond today They weren't here yesterday. They weren't here the day before So I'm thinking that maybe this pond tent that dill hole here put in my pond was full of tadpoles I don't either, but that's the only thing I think of. Probably not. So Brent decided to do this to my pond. And I know that it was payback for me stealing Penelope way back a long time ago. But you know, he had time to get me back. So today, I'm getting him back. Because today, we are filming the Flex Hill boat. I'm just going to let you know now, right up here in the beginning of this video, that I have a surprise for him. And it comes in about a 7 inch form factor. It's got a razor sharp blade on it. And I'm going to take it to Peggy. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not going to take it to Peggy. But I am, I am, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I got a good surprise for him. You just wait, just, just stay tuned in this video. Just watch, just, just watch. So before we get started, me and old Brenton here did a thing today. We went and met some subscribers over at the Serpentarium in Richardson, Texas. And before we get to what we're doing right now, we're gonna go ahead and roll that footage. So check this out. Make sure you go and subscribe to Merino Outdoors and Pyro Toad. They'll both be linked in the description. Check out the footage, it'll roll right now. All right, guys, so we are here, and I am sorry about my voice, but I have laryngitis. But we're here to do a thing. We're back at the Serpentarium in Richardson, Texas. And today, we are actually meeting a subscriber and we're gonna do a little filming with them. So we're at the Serpentarium. Howdy, partner. And Brenton has just received M&Ms from one of our subscribers. What's up? Mother, because he can't, like seriously? I didn't ask for them, she offered them. I wasn't gonna say no. Well, well, mm -hmm. well, right, but I'm just saying. Make sure you go subscribe, Hunter. Here, Merino Outdoors Pyro and Pyro Toad. Yeah. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed that. I'm sure you probably thought that we would never answer the phone or respond to text messages, but we actually do. So now, back to this video, is back to the Flex Seal boat. Brenton here, he decided he was gonna cut this boat in half. And now, we are gonna fix it with Flex Seal tape. And then I'm shipping Brenton here off into the middle of the lake and he's gonna be eaten by sharks. Ain't that right, Peggy? James, you shut your mouth, Wob. Taping this up. I will beat you in the ear hole. I can't even get that high. You know what I'm anyway. So stay tuned. Let's see what happens here. The boat has been put back together with flex seal tape. Now, it's off to the lake. Whoa. Sorry. I swear. Well, I think this dude right here is gonna get eaten by sharks today. Peggy. Dennis. Peggy, I'm telling you now, you're gonna sink and the sharks are gonna eat you. Bet. So, here we go. Stay tuned for this. I guarantee you, you're not gonna wanna miss this. Well, the boat has officially made it from the backyard to the front yard and is still in one piece. But I still say the boat's gonna sink and Peggy is gonna get eaten by sharks. Well, I'm not gonna get eaten by sharks. Yep, you are. Well, we got the boat loaded up. It is flex sealed together and uh, Peggy is gonna drown and be eaten by the sharks. Wow. Now, I have brought my GoPro because when we do sink, I wanna be able to film it. I also wanna be able to film the first bite from the shark attack. Well, we are here at beautiful Louisville Lake. Peggy, did you hear this? Did you hear him? I am gonna, I'm, I am going to, he's gonna get eaten by a shark. Anyway, we are here at beautiful Louisville Lake. Oh, we gotta get the boat out, so you're gonna have to hold on a minute. Peggy can't do this by himself. See, old Peggy doesn't think we need a plug in it, but I'm gonna put a plug in it, because 
Well, we want it to actually, it's not the right size plug. Hold on. Chris, there's no leaks. No leaks. How is there no leaks? Because it's a flex seal yeah. Here we go, guys. Seal is now broken. Well, so far, so good. There are no leaks. All right, let's start paddling out. Okay, well, how, why don't you get on one side and I get on the other and we paddle. I'm just moving us to the side a little bit. Okay, ready? Uh, we're paddling. We're paddling. No leaks in our flex seal, but oh, I see a little bit of water. Not too bad, though. This we is... gotta turn this way. Paddle out. Oh, no, we're, we're fine. I think we're fine. You think we're what? Fine. Pretty far from shores all the way back there. There's probably about 20 foot of water depth right here, I would say. It is definitely floating, dude. I am telling you, I am quite impressed with this. You're like five Like super. So <laughs> Peggy, if you want to get thrown in this water, keep it up. You understand? <laughs> hey, where are you paddling? You're paddling us in a circle. Good you, Lord. You, you sit on that side. I'm trying to paddle us around. Stop throwing the water in. <laughs> sit on the other side. Okay, there we go. Ready? Paddle. Straight. Row. All right. Oh, it's fine. Well, I would have to say that the flex seal boat worked. This worked 100%, dude. 100%. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Well, I'd say 96%. 96. 96%. Yeah, because, I mean, like, all of this, dude, no water's coming through this. I think it's back by the plug, though, where it's coming through. Yeah. It's back at that woodish trans yeah. transom area. What Brent doesn't know is I have a pocket knife that I am about to split this thing open with. And he's gonna drown. I don't know what to do now. I think we just sit here. Just sit here? Yeah. I mean, it was, it was cool. Mm -hmm. It was really cool. It was. Do you want to paddle back now? Huh? I mean, we can. We're trying to paddle back. Not quite working. You know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking old Brenton should have to swim back. What do you think, Brenton? We're not flipping this thing. <laughs> Guess what? Chris. We're not flipping it. No, no. Chris, Chris. Hey, hey, Brenton. Chris, 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 no. Chris, stop it. Oh, Chris, Chris, Chris. No, I don't like you anymore. Chris. No, Chris. Stop it. No. Chris. I'm done. We're going to see. I'm done, Brenton. Chris, Chris, we're pulling up really fast. There's water here. I'm Brenton. I'm done with you. I don't like you anymore. Guess what? Uh oh. Uh oh. Chris! Chris, we're taking off water from the fire. No, 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 no. Chris, we're filling up. <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna tell you now, this is a true testament to how good Flex Seal works. I need a thumbnail. Oh my god! Chris, we're taking up water from the sides. <laughs> Go back to the shore! <laughs> oh! No! No! Oh my god! It's like 20 gone. foot deep! It's gone! The boat, is, the boat gone. is gone! It's gone! It's gone! The boat's gone! Oh god! Oh my god! <laughs> my camera is soaking wet! Hey! So That's what you get for dying my pond blue. Thank you. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. All right. Well, Time to go back to that was fun. Why? We made Why? We could use that for so many more videos. Hey, it's not that far out there. We can go out there and treasure hunt it. We're going to treasure hunt them. Okay. I wanted to sell that on Facebook Marketplace. Well, we can. We'll just tell them where it's at. We'll just tell them where it's at. It's them. free. Brenton is now out trying to rescue the boat. No, but you did a good job. Look at that. Oh God, let me come rescue you. I'm coming, Peggy. I'm coming. Peggy, are you okay? Are you gonna make it? Peggy, I can't get past this fence. We're not supposed to be back there. Success that turned into a failure because Chris is in his pocket. Well, if you ask me, that was a success. 
complete success. From the Flex Seal product itself, it actually held. The only thing it couldn't hold up against was a razor sharp pocket knife. And and I'm telling you now, I think Brenton actually enjoyed taking a swim in the dirty old lake. What are you doing? I was I was putting my shirt up. Hey guys, how's it going? It's a little dark. Let me make it lighter. Lighter, lighter, lighter. See me a little better? Yeah. What's yeah. going on, guys? Let's go. I swear, I, it's just never ending. Do you see this right here? Hey. And he's texting his girlfriend right now. So if you guys want to see more crazy videos like that, make sure you hit that like button and comment below any crazy video ideas you have. Obviously nothing is out of the question as long as it's legal because we just cut a boat in half. Flex taped it back together and then sank it with a pocket knife. Yeah. And Brendan almost got eaten by a shark in a freshwater lake. How does that even happen? I don't know. Hey Peggy, success. Well, hopefully you guys liked that video. We definitely had a great time making that video. That's uh, We had such a great time. So hopefully you guys really enjoyed it. Sorry this video is coming out so late. It is literally right now, 10.52 at night. And uh, yeah, I'm just now filming this outro. So it took a lot of editing. I mean, we had so much funny content in that video today. It was hard to decide what we were gonna leave in there. So real quick, before I let you guys go, let's check on this 100 gallon and see what's going on in it, as well as check on the other tanks. So if we take a look here, everything looks good in here. There's the Pleco, all the Tetras and Cory Catfish. There's the Ballast Shark. There is the Yo-Yo Loach. Now, somebody told me that this is a yo-yo loach, and when I went in and I looked it up, it is actually a yo-yo loach. But when I bought this thing, they told me that it was a gold zebra loach. I have no idea, but it looks more like a yo-yo loach. That's how we're going to go with it. There's a guppy. There's a bunch of guppy in here somewhere. They're usually up at the top. This tall plant back here, I told you I'd tell you what this is. This stuff is called jungle veil. There's another one here, a little one. And then this up here is actually horn work. But this horn work is not actually going to stay in here. This is going to be used for a different project. It's just in here right now to, um, you know, keep it alive. Lot. So this stuff will be coming out and going into something else later on in a, in a later video. Everybody in here looks good. There is the feather fin catfish back here. You guys can see it right there. There is the Pleco. He's looking good. He actually spends a lot of time in this cave that we put together. So that's really cool. Here is the Minecraft tank. Everything looks good in there. The beta looks good. The beta is actually growing a lot and changing colors. It's a really pretty fish. And then over here we have the glow tank, which looks really good as well. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video today. I am so grateful for the support. I am grateful for all of it. So thank you so very much. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video today. If you have any crazy video ideas, definitely get in touch with me. My contact information is below, peggyandjanice at gmail.com, as well as there is a phone number there if you would like to leave a voicemail, call, or text. So, really, really appreciate it, guys. If you are new to my channel and you like to see crazy things like this, definitely subscribe because there is going to be more coming of this. If you have been here for a while and you have not subscribed or you have not followed me on Instagram, please do that now, and we will see you next time.